Hi guys, I'm Craig and I'm with Global Pest Solutions. Today we're going to hopefully help you deal with something we hear a lot about at our office. How to get ants out of your house. There's two main reasons that the ants come into the home. They come in for food and they come in for shelter. Let's start with the food. Eliminate any food source that you have in the house. Anything that's spilled, any debris, any crumbs. If you do this, you're going to make your house less attractive to the ants. As far as shelter. What you want to do is you want to try to secure your house the best you can. You want to look for gaps in window sills. You want to look for baseboards that have gaps, outlets, plumbing pipes that lead into the house, and get those sealed up to the best of your ability. Now, as far as eliminating the ants, most uh, local hardware stores will sell general insecticides. Most of these insecticides are what are known as repellents. So basically what they're going to do is, just like they say, they're going to repel the ants. So they're trying to get away from the formula which in essence, they work fine. For your general ant problem, they're gonna work just fine for you. What we use as professionals is what's called a non-repellent. And generally, you can only get this by professionals. What we're doing is we're putting down a chemical that's still a pesticide, but it's not a repellent, so they, they basically don't know it's there. They're gonna walk over it, they're gonna take it back to the nest, and it's very transferable. So when they groom each other and they feed, it's gonna transfer that pesticide from ant to ant, hopefully eliminating the colony. Um, other things you can do, you can put down dust, you can put down different types of baits. A lot of people use those baits that are at the store, they're gel baits. They're basically uh, sugar-based baits, and sometimes they'll work just, just fine for you. The whole idea is that they eat that, they consume it, they take it back and they share it, and eliminates the ant colony that way. If, if not, then you're going to have to go to a stronger product like a non-transferable or even hire a professional to come out. Um, they're going to uh, identify the ants. Every ant's going to have a different way of dealing with, a uh, different type of chemical, different type of makeup. So it just depends on what you're doing within your house. We deal with three common ants in our area. It's an odorous house ant, a pharaoh ant, and an Argentine ant. So by coming out and identifying that type of ant, we can then put together a program and decide what type of chemical we need to use for that ant. Well, hopefully this video helps you. If there's anything we can do for you, we're at Global Pest Solutions. Just give us a call. Thank you.